Hello, my name is Adam Bean and today I would like to answer the question what is a web component or what is a custom element? So let's create one custom element. So this is an element which is defined by us. It's a custom one. So let's create one with the name Hello World and the content Hello Duke. Now it's created and it appears on the screen. So this is not a custom element or web component yet. What happened right now is the browser just read this uh, tag. It recognized the dash, which means uh, it is a a custom element and created a diff like element with this content. But what we can do, we can provide some behavior and this has to happen with in JavaScript. So uh, what we have to do is we have to write a class with the name of our choice, but the class has to extend an HTML element and DOM element. And this is actually defined in the, um, in the, uh, specification so we have the html element and we have inherit from the element to create our own custom element so let's do this and uh, we have to use a browser api custom elements and the method name or the function name is defined and now we have to provide the name for the component and this was hello world and it has of course to match with the name uh, in html and then uh, this is the name of the tag and then I have to specify the class, this is hello world. So um, we have it, so nothing happened, but what we can do right now, we can react to a callback called connected callback. There's also disconnected callback, but now use the connected callback and we can provide some behavior. Let's say uh, name, name equals uh, Duke and um, we can create a custom message and by creating overriding the inner html and using the es6 template literal and then i can just do the h2 and let's say hey and then the message which is the uh the name and close h2 and seems to work so this was the simplest possible custom element or web component and uh, what we did we created our own tag and provided our own custom behavior. So thank you for watching. See you at upcoming conferences, AirHacks Live, AirHacks.io, or even projects. So thank you and bye.